Hi there folks, my name is J.W. Collins and today I'm going to show you the basic techniques of fingerstyle guitar. Technically there are five techniques. I uh, don't generally count the first one because it is a fundamental thing that you must do. So I basically just call them four techniques. The first one is, the fundamental one, is doing a 5-4-6-4 four, four pattern on your guitar with your thumb and your thumb pick. So I'm just going to play an A minor chord and do the two finger chord shot, uh, syncopation, uh, hammer-ons and pull-offs. And that's basically all there is to uh, finger style guitar. The first technique is with a thumb pick you have to do the basic bass pattern. 5-4-6-4 four, four, like this. down after several weeks of getting your thumb trained to do that. Um, one thing I will mention, when you're playing a chord structure with the root on the fifth string, it's going to be a 5-4-6-4 four, four pattern. If you change to a chord structure that has a root on the sixth string, it will be a 6-4-5-4 four, four pattern, like if I did an E major. basic techniques. Here we go. Every time your thumb hits the fourth string, you're going to do a two-fingered chord shot with the second and the third string at the same time. Every time your thumb hits the fourth, you're going to do a two-fingered chord shot right on top of it, like this. you get that down, you're playing two parts at once on the guitar. You're playing a bass line and you're playing a two-fingered rhythm. So now, the second technique, we're going to syncopate that two-fingered chord shot. The first one will be on the beat, on the fourth string. The second one will be the two-fingered chord shot just before you hit the fourth string. Like that. So together, should sound, it's like this. Okay. The third technique, we're going to separate these fingers now. And I'm going to play the third string separately, then I'm going to play the second string separately. And everything is going to be a syncopate with the bass. So everything will be played separately. I'm going to do my bass first on the five. Then the third string is all by itself, the fourth string bass, the second string lead, the sixth string bass, the third string lead, fourth string bass. So everything is separate. simple the lead line really is, this is all the lead is doing. That's it. But when you put the bass with it, it fills it pretty nice. Okay. Now, the next technique 
technique is hammer-ons and pull-offs. So we'll start with a pull-off and the pull-off will be a syncopate. When the pull-off happens, when I pull off this second string to an open note, to that note, it will be right on top of my sixth string bass like this. second string and when I hammer that on that's when you hit the bass right on top of the bass when the hammer on hits jwcollinsauthor.com where you can have access to purchasing my books. You can sign up to my email address there as well too which you'll receive a lot of free downloads and cool stuff, a lot of neat notifications of upcoming things that I have coming up. Um, and be sure to leave your comments and questions below and I will see you next time on my channel. Have a great day. Mm -hmm.